In this video, I'll be geek benching and testing the SSD on the all new 2013 11 inch MacBook Air. Alright, guys, so this is the new 2013 11 inch MacBook Air. I just did an unboxing of this as well as the 13 inch on my channel, youtube.com forward slash iTech Everything. So go ahead and check out the unboxings of both Airs if you missed it. Now, this Air goes for $9.99 in the US and $10.99 in Australia. If you are in the US, go ahead and buy it on Amazon in the link below to support the channel. Alright, so first up, Geekbench. Let's go ahead and go into Launchpad, and then we'll click on Geekbench. And this is the 64-bit version of Geekbench, so give us an accurate result. And we'll click Run Benchmarks. So as you can see, it's finished. We got a Geekbench score of 6,724. Now that's not too bad at all. So let's go ahead and um, check out some of the main points. We've got a processor integer performance of 5,020, a processor floating point performance of 8,587, memory performance of 6,255, and memory bandwidth performance of 7,114. And I'll go ahead and just scroll through this, but I won't read all these out because, yeah. Alright, so that's Geekbench. We'll go ahead and quit out of that. And just so you know, I am plugged in. So, yeah, just so you know. Now let's go ahead and launch Blackmagic Speed Test. And we'll click Start. So we're getting about 316 megabytes on the right and about 723 on the read. Wow. Yeah, so 316 on the right, about 720 on the read. That is fantastic. Alright, so that was a Geekbench test and SSD speed test on the new 2013 11-inch base MacBook Air. As I said, if you're in the US, go ahead and buy it on Amazon in the link below to support iTech Everything. Go ahead and drop a comment down below, give the video a thumbs up as I really appreciate it. Follow me on Twitter over at twitter.com forward slash iTechEverything and stay tuned for plenty more videos. See you guys in the next one.